Hi, it's Charlotte. Welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, it is Boxing Day and I thought I would film on what I got for Christmas because I literally loved all my presents this year. And again, I said this last year, I say this like every time, I really love watching these videos and I also really like looking back to like the presents I got in the past, which is kind of why I like filming this video. And it's kind of fun to just reflect back on what people got me. So yeah, that is it. It is Boxing Day. I will hopefully get this video up very soon, but I'm just gonna show you what I got for Christmas. I honestly don't know where to start. I feel like I just got spoiled rotten this year basically and I actually can't believe most of the things that I got. Also I really hope you had a really good Christmas and that you managed to spend it with someone. I know this year has just been really weird. I was really lucky this year as I got to spend Christmas with my dad, my stepmom and my little brother and I also got to see my boyfriend on Christmas day but yeah I'm just gonna get straight into it. I think I'm gonna do my family first. There's quite a lot. There's like stocking fillers and everything. First up something I definitely needed is sandwich boxes so i got these really cute like disney ones from the lion king i just can't wait to eat snacks and there's like a medium one and a little one inside as well and i just love these why not have a cute lunch box i mean what's the point of having a plain lunch box oh my god it's upside down so i just think these disney ones are really really cute i then got two pairs of fluffy socks i'm not going to show them for long because i've worn both of them already in fact i'm wearing a pair at the moment and one of them are these pink sparkly ones and i'm wearing some white polka dot ones at the moment as well and i just love fluffy socks so yeah <laughs> next up something that i definitely asked for i got a ultrasonic oil diffuser which looks like this and i also got some essential oils to go in it as well i can't tell you why I wanted these for a while. I just think they're quite aesthetic, I can't lie. And I just like a room smelling nice, but I don't always want to burn through candles. Um, it looks like this. I definitely wanted something that looked quite natural, either like white or wooden. So I really like the look of like these kind of ones. I'm not too sure what scents are in these oils. I'm just very excited to try it out. So I don't often get presents that I can play with. I must admit, so I'm quite excited to use it. I then got this little card game called Strawberry Sunset. I'm sorry if that light is too bright. It says, create a vibrant and flourishing strawberry patch. I think that's such a cute little card game. I'm really excited to play it. My little brother got a card game as well called Taco Cat Goat Cheese Pizza. We've been playing that and it's been really fun as well. I then, really randomly, me and my little brother both got recorders. I got a pink one and it's because we were both talking about the fact that something to do with like the fact we both can't play an instrument so i've got a little pink recorder i don't have to put a recorder just so you know i suppose learning could be fun if we have another lockdown i'll just be like <laughs> i always wanted to learn recorder i don't know i just feel like everyone learned recorder in primary school but i didn't so maybe i'll learn <laughs> i then also very excitingly was not expecting this got lily reinhardt's swimming lessons a poetry book oh my god that is so bright i'm really sorry I really wanted this for so, so long. In fact, I don't think it came out too long ago. It was definitely on pre-order for quite a while. I like quite soppy poetry. So from what I've heard, this will be up my street and I do love Lily Reinhardt. So I'm really excited to go through this. And I also got this little book of Chanel and I'm one of those suckers for coffee table books. So did my stocking and then I'm pretty sure I read this like Christmas morning. Like I read it straight away before my parents got up. So I found it very interesting actually. Then of course got a lot of chocolate. So we've got this little jelly bean gnome. Some like popping candy, coins and a pack of chocolate, which best believe is gonna take me so long to get through. I'm one of those people that like when I get given Easter chocolate, I still have it like two, three years later. I feel like that will annoy some people, but I just take so long to go through my sweets and chocolate. My family literally got me so many friends. <laughs> By the way, when I say my family, I mean my dad, my stepmom, my little brother. I feel like I didn't say that to begin with. They're the family that I live with. They also got me some strip fairy lights, which seems like, I don't know, boring. But I bought some 
the other week, but I accidentally bought cool lights, like they look blue and I bought the wrong ones. So they got me some warm lights to replace it. So I'm very excited to put those back up. <laughs> they then also got me this micro llama Nerf gun. My little brother is obsessed with Nerf guns. He has a lot. And he often ropes us all in for like a family Nerf gun fight. So I'm assuming the reason for this is so that I have my own Nerf gun for when we do that. I'm not gonna lie, like if I had to use a Nerf gun, I probably would use this one. It does look pretty damn cute and apparently it's from Fortnite. My little brother then got me these little Christmas tree earrings which are so cute and to be fair I needed some new earrings like this because I had some old ones that I've just had for years and they were getting a bit old so I really really like these ones. They then got me two red and green velvet scrunchies. I just thought to sort of live in this kind of thing Christmas. Well, I mean I live in scrunchies but red and green scrunchies are just perfect for Christmas and I wore the green one on Christmas day and I absolutely loved it. I then got this sheet mask duo. I love these sort of sheet masks. I mean, sheet masks are my favorite kind of masks, but especially like these ones because they're just so damn cute. There's an avocado one and a cucumber one. They then also got me this little key ring. It's got a little C and like a red for Ruby, which is my birthstone and a little Eiffel Tower because I'm a bit obsessed with Paris and everybody knows it. So I thought that was quite a cute little present. I feel like I'm absolutely racing through these. There's actually quite a lot to go through, so I kind of have to. I apologize. <laughs> they also got me, oh, is that showing? I kind of was expecting this and not. I definitely said something boba tea related, but I wasn't expecting them to get me a whole bloody, kind of like a subscription box, but I mean, it's just for one month but oh my god, you get so much with it. I am gonna try and show without it all falling out. It came really nicely packaged, but I've taken a lot of the packaging out. You get a lot. I'm gonna show you what you get. I absolutely love boba tea, and it, it makes me sad when I haven't had it in a really long time, you know? So you get cups, you get big straws, you then get I don't know if they had to pick things on the website, I'm, I'm not really not too sure how it works, but I've got lychee, popping boba, cherry, and peach. Oh my god, they're literally like the best ones. Maybe you can choose flavours. <laughs> you then get loads of sort of tea flavours, there's like tea pouches, but I mean I think, I mean I don't really know how it works. There's tea pouches here. You then get some tapioca pearls. I'm not gonna lie, I'm not too sure how I feel about these. These are the chewy ones, not the popping ones, but you know what? We're gonna need to try it out again because who knows. <laughs> Last but not least, you get the syrups. So there's strawberry, passion fruit, green apple, and pineapple. I'm definitely most excited for the passion fruit and strawberry, I think, because I definitely prefer like the berry, the sort of like peachy, passion fruity ones. Yeah, I just thought that kit is so cute and absolutely perfect. I can't wait. It actually looks like a bit of a mission. There's a lot of rules. Rules? Not rules instructions on how to make them but i'm really excited for it okay and then last but not least from my parents and my little brother i got the best present in the whole world what i mean i literally this was up there was something that i just thought i wasn't gonna be able to afford for a very very long time i'm just gonna get on with it i got <laughs> the way i'm carrying this i'm sorry it's very long is the cricut explore air 2 for like to most people this will mean nothing but let me tell you it is a smart cutting machine and if you haven't seen every single one of my videos i own an etsy shop and i've just started to sort of design my own stickers which i've been ordering from a website like ordering my designs then coming here and then i'm selling them on my etsy shop and then i've just started to do my own prints as well using my printer i basically just really like the idea of being able to do everything by myself and not having to order them I feel like you're just not going to end up really making money that way. You know, it's just nicer being able to make everything yourself. So I really wanted this. And I think basically my parents kind of knew that it would help me along a lot with my Etsy shop. Yes, I'm very excited to start using this. In fact, I even started setting it up last night. I have ordered some sticker paper because I can't really start doing anything until I've had the right uh, materials. But yeah, I'm very excited to start using this. So thank you parents very much. I am obsessed and they never need to buy me anything ever again, basically. So from Emma, she got me two jelly cat toys. I am, I said I'm obsessed with jelly cat, but I mean, I am, even though before this Christmas I haven't owned anything. But oh my God, if you feel jelly cat toys, 
I know I'm 22, but they're just so soft and cuddly. So she got me this cute little white bunny with like silver stars in the ears. In fact, I'm pretty sure my mum, I feel like my mum has these, I have to check with her. But I just thought this was so cute. And I did really want one of the bunnies, to be fair. It just in this like really nice white colour, I just think is super, super cute. And she also got me a little egg. Although everyone keeps calling this a weird avocado or a white avocado. It is obviously not an avocado, it's an egg. Um, <laughs> I just think that is so cute as well. So I absolutely love both of these. Wasn't expecting them at all. And then also my friend Evangeline got me a Beauty Bay palette, which I've never tried Beauty Bay makeup. I don't think I've ever tried any makeup from Beauty Bay, but especially the eyeshadow palettes I know a lot of people rave about. I've seen Jordan Lipscomb use them before in a video, and she said they were really good. This is the 42 color palette. I really hope that's the name of the palette. It looks like this. Oh wow. I don't have any palettes this big basically or just with this amount of colours in I absolutely love it the mattes I'm loving like every single shade <laughs> I feel like I'll get so much use out of this palette and it's so so pretty thank you Evangeline I might do a first impressions video of this that's a good idea let me know if you would like that because I've never tried beauty bit eyeshadows before so I feel like that would be a good video to do I then also did Secret Santa with my work and there were a lot of people that did the secret santa so i think the person that got me actually didn't really know me properly i think they had to ask someone but they actually did pretty well i'm not still too sure who got me but they got me some gel pens this will just go into my little etsy trolley cart because they're just really cute colors so i love that they then also got me an MS candle which i'm not gonna like wouldn't be my go-to candle it's called noel mandarin clove and cinnamon but it smells really, really good. And it actually looks quite cute as well. I love that it's just, if you could see that in gold, it just says Noel, and it actually smells really, really good. They did well. I think someone just told them that I like candles probably, which is true. I feel like it got passed around that I like Harry Potter. So they got me a little notebook and a sorting hat pen, which I just think is so cute. It's definitely not my public aesthetic to the world. Like I keep certain parts hidden. This is part of it. <laughs> so I'll just secretly use this in my bedroom. <laughs> and then I'm gonna go on to like my other family, what they got me. I actually haven't done presents with my mum and my stepdad and sisters yet as I haven't seen them. I'm hoping I get to see them soon, hopefully, so that we can exchange presents. So from my granddad, he gave me 50 pounds, which I'm not gonna lie, I really don't know what I'm gonna do with. I have a feeling that I'm gonna put it towards my Etsy shop supplies, so I had to buy sticker paper, I kind of need to buy some tools from Hobbycraft, so I think I'm just going to put it towards materials for my Etsy shop, putting it towards my future. And then my uncle and his girlfriend got me a gift card to HomeSense, it's the way to my heart, I, I can't wait to go to HomeSense honestly, it's probably going to be a blanket or a cushion, but I'm, I'm very excited to go because I don't think I've ever had a gift card for HomeSense before, so it excites me. And then from my aunt, she got me quite a few bits. She likes to get quite a few presents, which, I mean, is always fun to unwrap. <laughs> she got me some body butters. There's a lavender, a eucalyptus, and a blue shawls. I thought those looked really cute. I like how they're quite small because I feel like I never really get through things very quickly. If someone gives me like a big pot of something, I'm never gonna get through it. So I do like how they're quite small. Then got me some friends lunch boxes. Honestly, apparently everyone got the memo that I need sandwich boxes and now I'm sorted because I went from having none to having a lot. And they're friends. I love friends, so this is just amazing. She then got me some Ted Baker eau de toilettes. I don't think they're sprays, they're like little bottles. So I don't know if they're the kind that you dab onto your wrist. I feel like they could be, but they look super cute. <laughs> and they're like this. And then she got me some bath rocks and I absolutely love these. They look so cute. It's quite funny because I think I got her something quite similar. I got her like a little bottle of um, bath salts and like in this exact color. So I think it's quite funny. We obviously think very similar because we always get each other quite similar presents. Hello. And then last but not least, she got me a friend's water bottle. So I'm just set for going for lunches at work or 
going for lunches anywhere. I just think these are so cute. Like these with my little lunch boxes, so cute. <laughs> I think all that's left is my boyfriend and his family. Like, so I'm probably gonna start off with what I opened first, which is what's been sat on my lap for this whole video. <laughs> He also got me a jelly cat toy because honestly I just go on about it non-stop so and funnily enough he didn't get me a bunny because I always go on about the bunnies but luckily he didn't so he got something different to Emma. <laughs> Look how cute it's a little elephant but it's in this like really cute like beigey colour and I'm absolutely obsessed. It is so soft I can't tell you and it's possibly one of my favourite presents. It's just so cute and I wasn't expecting it. Yeah, I absolutely love that. <laughs> then he also got me a mug, which is funny because I already have this mug. I bought it about two, three months ago, but he said he saw and he thought of me, which I mean, I do understand that because it's got a fossil on it. Um, and he's right. I, I love this mug. So now I have two, which is absolutely fine because I love this mug anyway. So I'm happy to have two of them. This one's from Paper Chase. Ooh. There was water in that as I tipped it. And then last but not least, my main present for my boyfriend, he got me a pair of AirPods. Can you see that? It looks like a white box to me. I mean, it is a white box, but I mean, literally just all I can see in the camera is white. <laughs> I've wanted AirPods for quite a while. When they first came out, I don't know when that was, quite a while ago, wasn't it? When they first came out, I was like, oh, like, eh, no, no. Even when they came out with these new ones, the newest version, these aren't the newest version because I don't really like the look of the new ones. I was like, no, I don't see it. But <laughs> I got some fake ear pods a few months ago and they were awful, like really bad quality. They didn't work. And all it did was make me want AirPods. And then ever since all I've wanted was AirPods. Um, so yeah, these are the AirPods. I don't know what you call them, like version one. I, I didn't want the newest ones and he knew that because I liked the shape of the original ones. Um, I don't know why I'm opening this. I've already got them out. <laughs> he also got me a little case that says Charlotte on it as well. You probably can't see there, so I'll insert a close up. Yeah, I'm so excited to start using these. I just feel like they're so convenient, no wires, no problem. I absolutely love these and again, something I've really, really wanted for such a long time. So from my boyfriend's parents, oh my God, they got me quite a lot to be fair. <laughs> I'm gonna start off with the smallest things. They got me some Peach Fizz candy kittens. I love candy kittens so much. The Eat and Mess ones are so, so good. These are peach. So I actually haven't tried these ones before, but I just love them so much. But I think they're, yeah, they're vegan. So that's so good. It's quite hard to find chewy sweets that are like vegan or vegetarian. So I can't wait to eat these as well. I feel like I have a lot of food to get through now. They then also got me this ring from Calvin Klein. And I've been a bit ring mad recently and looks like this can you even see that i'll just drop it that's that's fine i don't know if you can see that there it is rose gold again i'll do a close-up it's probably for the best if i put it on that finger you might be able to see can you see that there it's quite a chunky ring but i have been liking my chunky rings i really like mixing thin chunky silvers golds i don't know i like just going a bit ring mad and i really I'm such a plus today I really like this basically. Yeah, I can't wait just to be wearing loads more rings. <laughs> and then last but not least, they got me a pair of Converse, which I wanted for so, so long, but I just couldn't, I just know, I just couldn't just buy it, to buy it randomly myself. I have never owned a pair of Converse high tops and I've wanted the white ones for ages basically. They are quite, um, they've got quite a platform on them. I must admit, but I didn't really want the ones with like a red and a blue stripe on them. I just wanted the ones that were plain white. Yeah, I guess we'll see, but it's gonna make me a bit taller, but I absolutely love them. And I can't wait to style these with so many outfits. Literally, even like on Christmas day, I was still contemplating getting these. I'm really glad I got these. <laughs> Next from my boyfriend's granddad and uncle, I got quite a few presents. So first I got this Kiki K planner stickers and postcards. I wanted this so so much i can't even tell you i've been like counting down the days to receive this basically it is just absolutely perfect you get at the start of the planner yearly dreams can you even see that so you know what? i say this but sometimes in the video when i'm editing i'm like you can really easily see that basically you put like a yearly dreams bucket list and then it's like a monthly and you can track what you're eating your water intake which i need because i don't drink enough and at the end of every month you sort of have like a take time to reflect and at the start you have a monthly goals. I'm just so excited to be tracking all like my YouTube videos, my Etsy shop in here, everything. 
because I feel like I just have so much going on in my head that I just need to write it all down. And as much as like my iPad is great for a lot of things, I do always need something like this, like just, just like one little planner because an iPad just, you just can't take it everywhere. So I can't wait to start using this. Then got two like baking cookies books, although like, they're quite heavy. They look like this. I absolutely love these so much. I basically am trying to build up a baking slash cooking book collection. I actually have quite a few to be fair and I just can't wait to be able to have like my own place and my own kitchen. See my own kitchen, my, my boyfriend's own kitchen, just to be baking more because I, I just need to bake more to get better at it basically. But these just look amazing so yeah. I'm really happy to have these so I'm probably going to put these away like store them away until I move out. I love those too. And then I also got two knitted, I think they could possibly be berries. I need to find out. I will take them out later and discover but they're either just like knitted um, hats or berets. There's a pink one and a navy blue one as well. We are just constantly living in hats. I have so many so yeah I really love those ones as well. And last but not least for my boyfriend's aunt, uncle and cousin I got a few makeup bits which to be fair no one else got me makeup. To be fair I mean I really I'm really into my makeup actually not many people buy me makeup. It's probably because I buy so much myself that everyone else just thinks, well I mean she just buys it herself all the time, what's the point? Which to be fair I, I do understand. It is exciting to unwrap a little bit of makeup so I'm actually really happy that I got this. So first I got this face halo like mitt. I know exactly what this is and I'm trying to explain it well. You literally just like dampen it and then it just takes your makeup off without like anything on it and I really can't wait to use this because I've just I just like to try and not use wet wipes if I can or makeup wipes so this will be really handy so yeah I really really can't wait to use this. They then got me the Vegan Beauty Legendary Icons so you get a mascara, eyeliner and liquid lipstick. I actually haven't tried the mascara or eyeliner before but the liquid lipstick this shade is actually one of my favourite liquid lipsticks. Like I have the full size of this, so that's actually quite good that there's like a little mini version for me because I already love this shade. So I really like that as well. They also got me a little travel brush Zoeva makeup brush kit. I have heard about Zoeva makeup brushes so much, but I actually haven't ever bought any, I don't think. Now I've bought Morphe brushes, I've bought an It Cosmetics brush, but I've never bought Zoeva brushes. I've always wanted to, but they're like a little bit pricey, so I just never have. So I think it's quite nice to have a little travel makeup brush kit. I can't wait to use those as well. I am pretty sure that is everything. Like, oh my lord, I am sorry that I've... Oh, to be fair, I've only been talking for 10 minutes. That isn't too bad. <laughs> Honestly thought I'd been a lot worse. I am so grateful for everything that I've been given. If you got me any of these presents, then thank you so much. Don't know what to do with everything, honestly. I just can't wait to start using everything. <laughs> but yeah, I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, then please give it a big thumbs up. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you're new to my channel. And... Apart from that, I can't wait to start making some more videos and I'll see you soon. Bye!